Tuloy pa rin ang pamamayagpat ng Cool Smashers kontra sa Perla Spikers. Just two days after winning in the last match of the preliminary round. Maganda ang pinapakita ng kubo ni Coach Ty Bundit, Eliza Valdez. Tuloy-tuloy pa rin ang pag ng puntos and the Perla Spikers have to find an answer for these girls in hot pink tonight. Yeah, and you did mention it, no? They kind of got got the momentum from that previous win against the same team. So today, they're playing, you know, like a co very cohesive unit, which is a good sign for the Cool Smashers. Everybody contributing to their cause. Valdez, even Colleen Bravo, everybody just stepping up. And look at, in terms of attacks, they're ahead 13 to 8, blocking even service aces. One for the Cool Smashers. Unforced errors is a, a big difference. That's three points for you. Eight for Perlas and five for the Cool Smashers. So as a whole, Cool, cool Smashers just playing it cool, really, <laughs> in today's game. Perlas has got to dig deep because, you know, you don't want to start the quarterfinals with a loss. And you know that they can play better if they talk, if they communicate. You know, remember, Amy Am Ahumido has said it's the game phase of uh, the Cool Smashers in that last game. So they're hoping today they bring out their game phase. And what's at stake for the Cool Smashers dito sa Laban, Laban Aton Noreen is a chance to come up with back-to-back -back wins. And they have not won back-to-back -back wins here in this reinforced conference. So if they can finally have that momentum, finally put uh, wins together, then that could spell trouble for the, the rest of the league in the PBL. Oh yeah, I mean, we know that Eliza Valdez, when you team up with imports, is very deadly. And what's nice and for the Cool Smashers is scores one the gelling came when they needed it, you know, coming into the quarterfinals. Because, uh, like I said earlier, they kind of struggled in the start of the conference. Service. But, you know, it's how you learn from your, your losses that counts. At one point, the Cool Smashers were at 2 and 4. You can see the before Dao started playing. And even when Dao uh, played, coming into that match last Thursday against Perlas, 3 and 6 a cartada ng Cool Smasher. So they were really off to a shaky start deep as a PVL. Yeah, and we got to mention also, had Perlas won that game, they're, they're, they would be number two. Yeah, they wouldn't be playing right now. <laughs> They'd be resting. Ganun ka importante, ganun ka bigat yung uh, pagkatalo ng Perlas nung Webes contra sa Cool Smashers. Alright, palikan muna natin ang mga tweets. Hear it me, Donny Aquino. Shout out to my best Susie friend, Colleen Bravo. Best friend, wow. Ang init ng laban, ang aga pa lang. Wow, like from Muscat, Uman. 45 degrees. Oh, oh, oh. Wow. From Super Jane Garcia. Ang ganda ni Bravo po. So nice to see Cool Persona, Smashers enjoy again. inside the court. Three, two, one. Super Jane. And this is from Richie. Valdez and her Vasho. No cheering at this time. Ang hirap because I love them both. <laughs> so you're torn, Richie. <laughs> <laughs> so, si Richie na yung pangalawang tan na hindi alam kung sino ang papanigan dito sa laban ito. Valdez, nobody home on that spike. Richie, you can clap for Valdez with that, <laughs> that kill. <laughs> that classic Eliza for you. Talagang paon. Tinanong ko si Eliza about her stint in Thailand. I asked her uh, about her experience sa 3BB na Cornon. So, naging teammate niya itong si Dao. At silang dalawa, yung open spikers. But Eliza and Dao weren't the, the leading scorer on 3BB. The leading scorer was a member of the under-23 Si Pinchaya, who plays the utility position. So, so, ibang experience yun para kay Eliza Valdez sa 3BB. Yeah, I'm sure. And aside from the fact that it's a humbling experience, so it's when you're there, you just look forward to learning it every, every game that you play. Kasi yun naman talaga yung goal ni, ni Eliza. But as you said, a humbling experience because dito, she's a superstar. Yeah. But, but uh, in Thailand, diba, she had to learn how to play with a different team. Okay, balik ka muna natin si Gan Krishnan. Well, Anton, and the reasons you guys are talking about Eliza Valdez, alam nyo ba na may bagong sports itong si Eliza? Alam yes. nyo ba kung ano to? Lost. Ito nga ay ang golf. Nakasama Sorry. niya nga daw ang friends niya pag golf. Pero sabi niya kung mag-golf nga daw siya, hindi daw siya magiging pinom. Dahil nga, lagi nga daw siya nakaupulang daw sa my cart. Dahil nga, 
Masyado daw mainit pag nag-golf. At uh, sabi niya nga sa akin, may, medyo morena na nga daw siya. Kung so, golf pa daw siya, baka daw lalo siya maging morena. Pero sabi niya nga, very um, happy siya to be playing golf. And of course, hindi pa rin niya pa din daw kakalimutan ang maglalaro ng volleyball. Lalo na nga ngayon na talaga sobrang galing ni Alaysa Valdez. Back to you, Antonio Marine. Don't you play golf, Doreen? I did. I did. Okay. But I'm scared of the sun then. But I stopped. <laughs> no, no, really. No, really. No, no. But as tayo, I'm also afraid Five of the sun. <laughs> no, but you know what's good about the sport? It's, ba, alam natin, it's a, there is a mental substitution. Yes. Yes. So it teaches a player to really focus on your your patience and your discard. So good for Eliza. Service. It's uh, patience. Patience yung... Because I tried doing golf at, at yung patience yeah, talaga yung nakita kong pinakakailangan ng aspect <laughs> sa naro na yun. <laughs> Two different Go to types of games, volleyball and, and, and golf. Yes, player. Bupian in. Ayan, ayun po si Eliza Valdez. The golfer. Slash volleyball player. The volleyball player who wears basketball shoes for play. Yeah. Always, di ba? <laughs> as far as we can remember. Hervasho, cross court, popped up by Rak Rakin. Shout, binigay dito kay Dao. Hashimoto, quick attack for Sasa De Vanadera. Quick attack. I think that's a great uh, substitution for Coach Jerry bringing Sasa De Vanadera because for those who have followed the V-League, they've known Sasa De Vanadera to be a very, a, a player yes, who player. they've discarded, yeah? Yes, poker face, I mean, everybody knows Sasa to be poker face, pero she's talaga better than the lady. Reliable. Dao. Cabanos, binigay dito kay Valdez. And Valdez. Valdez sees the hole. Maybe Six something off. she learned from playing with 3BB na for not. Yeah, smart tip there. Pupia could not get to that one in time. Valdez is also Valdez. number one server Sir. in the lead. Coming into this match with 22 service aces. Make that 23. Oh, yeah. You did it, Jinxer. No, no, no. That's a good <laughs> thing. That's a good sign. On cue. And Coach Jerry looking on as Service. Perlas. Oh, Nangirapan yes. dito. Nangirapan sila i-cool off with the cool smashers. Villanueva. Hupia Inc. Brigay dito kay Z. Hervasho. Hervasho hits the line. Nakuha sa kanto. 7-0. Seven 7-0. All. Seven yeah. all. They need more of that from her. That, that's the way she's been playing at the start of the conference. So glad to know that she's almost 100%. Team captain. Z. Hervasho. Leading also. Service. Telling uh, Ella where to position herself. Talagang kaabang-abang yung mga serves ni Zina ganyan. Kaya lang, sumobra sa puwersa sa pagkakataon na yun. Cool Smashers lead Perla Spikers 8-7. Magbabalik po ang PBL dito sa SNA. Hi, Hupia! My name is Mina Erika Madriaga from Makati. My question is, what is your favorite place here in the Philippines and why? Thank you! Hi! Uh, my favorite place in the Philippines is Palawan for sure. Uh, I've been there for like a week, I think, and uh, it's so beautiful. You know, like uh, the entire time I was there, I was getting to know different places, different like cultures and families, communities. So it was fun. It was a good time. Ayan ang sinasabi ko, talagang uh, at home na at home itong si Hupia Inc. Lalo na kasama yung mga BVR girls, si Amy, si Z. Uh, her first time in the Philippines was 2015. She competed in uh, one of the BVR legs sa Sands, uh, Likod ng Ball of Asia. Uh, an event that we covered actually. Each person pala to si Hupia Inc. One week in Palawan. Wow. Sasa de Vanadera. And the thing about some of these reinforcements, uh, they love the beach, they, they, and, and some of them even uh, have been to the beach longer than Philippines. <laughs> oh, not there. One week, that's a long week. Perlas, <laughs> now we'll talk by one. Lamang na po ang Perlas Spikers, 9 to 8. Service. 
Devanadera. Yeah, Sasa Devanadera to serve it up for the Perla Spikers. Valdez receives it. Cabanos quick attack para kay Bravo. And Tonsolin. Bravo. Uh, sending that one way out. Yeah, miss hit there. But if you're, you know, Perla Spikers, two fans you should be happy because Perlas. they're starting out strong here in the second set. Devanadera. Charo Soriano. One of the founders of Beach Volleyball Republic at Silay Maniniwala and the DVR uh, can help the Philippines become a beach volleyball hub in Asia. I think she's the manager of Perla. Yep. Yeah. Amanda Villanueva making her presence felt here in the second step. Dancing. Told you there's a dance craze in the Laga. Uh, it's DJ Dronich's fault. <laughs> Plus one for Greenland. <laughs> Even the, the big head cutouts are dancing. <laughs> Remember? He searched for it. Big pick a big head snare. Big head cutout. Yep. <laughs> 11 to 9 ang ating tala at Cabana serving it up. Hashimoto binigay dito kay Villanueva who has always been a high flyer. Yeah. And well, that, that was a smart hit going cross court, right? Really eluding itong si Shout. Yes, player. Now Perla is just trying to you know, get back at, at the cool smashers right now. Mas pagandang uh, galaw ng kanilang kubunan. Now showing us her power again. Hashimoto, free ball. Valdez, pinasa dito kay Cabanos. Back set para kay Dao. For the second time, Perlas is able to foil Dao's attack. And Billion Weber breaks down the wall. She's in the zone today. <laughs> Panoorin natin muli. The former Lady Falcon soaring and scoring for the Perlas Spikers. Tamang tama, kaka-feature lang natin sa kanya. And she is... Stepping up today. Service. You know what I just realized? Um, we have Villanueva and uh, Rakrakin on the other side. The lower players na nag-insayo para sa Lasal. But because of the extremely difficult uh, cool uh, roster, they, they had to move elsewhere. This match is brought to you by Rebisco, making delightful moments possible anytime, anywhere. The combination of Coach Tai and Coach Oh! Two champion coaches from Ateneo. They compliment each other. Really. <laughs> the, the Lady Eagles and the and the Blue Eagles practice at the same time in the same gym. <laughs> so, that's the atmosphere in the Ateneo. Second technical timeout. Samantala, for the Spikers, lead the Bulls Smasher 16 to 9. Hi, Mimi Alcantara from Caloocan. Uh, hi, Cheska. May tanong ako sa'yo. Sa bago mong role ngayon bilang libero at ang husay mo, paano ka naka-adjust sa bagong role mo? Thank you! Actually, hindi na baga, bago sa akin yung role ng libero kasi natry ko na rin maglaro ng libero before sa dati kong school. And hindi na bago yung pagdepensa dahil open spiker din ako. So hindi ganun kahirap yung adjustment para sa akin. Now, well, one thing I've always noticed about Cheska Rakra... Rakrakin is the confidence. A uh, very confident young lady. Nagdalaro uh, para sa San Peda. Red Lionesses. At uh, hinirang pa bilang Miss NCAA Volleyball. Yeah. Sa Down the Line program. No, that's gonna make a lot of difference. You know, if you, with a if quick you have confidence, if you believe nine. that you can get better, then you can better. That's the first step. Service. Hashimoto. And uh, we have some info sheets here. 
which we get the players to fill up. And as said by Cheska Rafraquen dito in, in one of the info sheets, what are some negative points in you? Sabi niya, I tend to underestimate myself a lot. Green lang. <laughs> parang, parang baliktad. <laughs> a lot of babies here in, in the PBL. Uh, kanina sa ating uh, intro, nakita natin yung uh, baby ni uh, Kong Lino and, and Phil, uh, si Baby Ino. So cute also. Service. Uh, kanina, nanalo nga ang uh, Lady Warriors kontra sa Lady Jets Spikers in a five-set match. That was a long match. Uh, <laughs> for Bravo. Really long. 20 to 9. Here's the second set. The first set, Spikers really Pulling away from the cool smashes. Ibang iba yung laro nila here in the second set. And Coach Oliver wants to swing the momentum back in their favor. Denied by Villanueva. Dao has been uh, denied a lot here in this uh, in this match, Noreen. Okay, balikan muna natin mga tweets. Honey Rich Miranda says, Go Green Line! Watching all the way from Iloilo. I love you. I like it like this. Kaya niyan. Woo! <laughs> And we got Hayley, Go Kiwi, Go Burlesque Spikers. 21. Hey, hey, thanks for watching. From Justin Carpio. Hi po sa pinaka... Wow. Ako magpapasa. Baka to rin ko yan. Hindi ako magpapasa. Pinaka magaling mag-commentator, Anton Rojas. Hello, Justin. Ingat ka dyan ha. Medyo madinim ata yung lugar sa profile pic mo. Pero salamat. Magaling din itong si uh, Aido Kovic. <laughs> 23, Janan. Talaga magaling ko si Anton. No, no, no. Si Good Vinny comment. tsaka si Pia. Substitution? Ito ang magaling. Ito talaga ang magaling. Super. Legend, si Ivy Super. Remulia. Remulia. In. Yeah, I, th I think it's a, it's a good substitution, no? Because here in the second set, obviously, Sir, na check set, he could eat Bravo. Yeah. What does Ivy do? I mean, um, her job and then the block is playing, the, the practice, the that, that's, that's very demanding. Yeah, I, I remember you featured her yes. also, and really what, what she said was it's really the passion for the sport. You make the time, even though pagod na pagod ka na. But because you love to, to play, you really have to go travel and play. Well, what really uh, stood out for me was her uniform. <laughs> In that picture. In that in the bar. <laughs> yung blazer ne. Talagang ano eh, boss and that thing. Oh, and then the witch it ended na naka cream light <laughs> yeah. in yeah. the bar. Because yeah. I know the bar. <laughs> <laughs> 25. The Perla Spikers were able to cool off the cool smashers in set number two, winning in dominating fashion. Tingna natin kung sino ang manana eggs sa set number three. Ito po. Uh, reinforced conference of Premier Volleyball League, dito lang sa SNA. 